I was a huge fan of the franchise. I think they're really fun. I think uh, Chad is one of the best action directors out there. I've met him a few times before, and then he approached me with this thing, and I said, oh, yeah. The way Chad described him to me is, is he, he's sort of the new sheriff in town. Um, I'm not quite sure exactly how the table works and the structure of it, and it's purposefully kept a bit of a secret and a mystery in, in, the, in the world of John Wick. But he's appointed at a high position to surprise, surprise, track down and kill John Wick. And he's kind of been elevated to this position and he's off his leash, which means that he could basically implement whatever he wants and whatever he thinks is necessary to get it done. That's been incredible. I mean, I don't think I've ever worked on a production before where I've been in these opulent, uh, over-the-top, um, exclusive locations. I mean, we've been shooting in Paris and I've gotten to uh, shoot at the Versailles stables that they shut down for us, the opera house that they shut down, which supposedly is the most expensive location in all of Paris, so check. And then the Louvre, they shut down the Louvre, which was amazing. Working with Ian has been a bit of a high point for me in this job. I mean, I was such a huge fan of his before, obviously. He's a legend and just such a fun guy, too. Just like hearing stories about, you know, what he was up to in the 60s. <laughs> oh, wow. And the people that he met in the industry at that time. It's like, I don't know, you don't meet a lot of people like him. He plays the tracker and he's in it for the money. Um, he tracks down people of interest and reports their locations and uh, the marquee finds a use for him. There's a bit of a Western flair to his outfit, sort of like mid to late 1800s uh, cut of the suits. Paco is obviously an amazing costume designer and, and I, I think he had a lot of fun with it. There's a lot of uh, uh, black suits with black ties in this franchise and uh, the marquee uh, gives it a little bit more of a sparkle, I guess. Every location, there's a different suit, different color, and. It's glitter and gold, so um, what's not to like about it? He's Keanu Reeves. Like, I grew up with the Matrix franchise and, like, been a big fan of his uh, ever since I was a kid. And he really cares. I really like him and his approach, and he's like a true cinephile, you know? He knows movies, he knows exactly how he wants the scene to be shot. And then he's a very generous director. He kind of lets you play around with it, and if you're going out too far, if he comes and steers you the right way, and, and, and yeah, but predominantly, I mean, mainly, gives you a lot of, of freedom to explore the scenes.